Beetlejuice utilizes a variety of methods and devious tactics to do what he does best, which is scaring the holy hell out of everyone. From cunning tricks to formidable mystical abilities, Beetlejuice presents himself as being nearly invincible. So, how powerful is Beetlejuice? One of his notable abilities is the capacity to project his voice from different locations. Whether simulating speech from a distant room or mimicking another individual's voice, Beetlejuice has mastered the skill of ventriloquism. Among his frequent powers is the adeptness to flawlessly imitate others. For instance, when Beetlejuice intervenes as Lydia and him are about to exchange marriage vows, he silences Lydia while professing her consent on her behalf, perfectly replicating her voice. Beetlejuice possesses the power to manifest and materialize objects at will, effortlessly wielding this ability and others without apparent exertion. Absent of a wand incantation or hand gesture, he seemingly materializes things through mere thought. Capable of morphing his appearance to mirror another individual or altering his size and shape, Beetlejuice effortlessly transforms into grotesque creatures and monsters, as well as mimicking those he encounters. His size-altering ability extends to deceased individuals, as seen when he diminishes Adam and Barbara to fit into a miniature town Adam constructed. One of Beetlejuice's most remarkable abilities enables him to manipulate reality itself, influencing what those around him perceive and encounter. From reshaping room layouts to constructing entire hellish landscapes with sandworms, Beetlejuice can manipulate his environment at will. As an undead entity, Beetlejuice proves to be resilient. Due to his undead nature, it seems that he is impervious to serious harm with the full extent of his invulnerability undisclosed. Notably, Beetlejuice withstands being devoured by a colossal sandworm, a perilous fate for the undead and other ethereal beings. What other powers does he have that I missed? 